I couldn't remember a, a, a sitting attorney general actually going into a, a district court to argue anything. I mean, the last one was probably Dan Morales. Uh, what was your fear? Uh, my, my, I mean, General Paxson has wo some wonderful qualities, but he is not a litigator. And, and to think that, that he would go into court arguing a motion just, just made absolutely n no sense, and especially on a matter, I mean, this isn't the Google case. This wasn't a Supreme Court argument. This was, with all respect to those who practice in Travis County District Court, it was Travis County District Court. All right, Mr. Mateer, as a result of your concern, did you organize a meeting? I, I did organize a meeting that morning. That's all I'm asking right now. All right, and, and who all did you have at that meeting? Well, I, I had Mr. Paxton, uh, and I had Blake Brickman, and I had Mark Rylander, who was the deputy of communications. Okay, and uh, at that director meeting, of communications. what was your intent for that meeting initially? I, I mean, I wanted to find out what Mr. Paxton was thinking, because, I mean, just, it was inconceivable to me that he would want to go to district court to argue something. Did you know at that time on whose behalf the argument would have in effect been? I think, Mr. McCarty, I would have, yes, I would have known. And who was that? Well, it would have been, it would have been in the Mitty Foundation at the urging of Mr. Paul. All right, and when you, when you had the meeting, before you started talking about other things with the Attorney General, what did you discover in terms of whether somebody had changed his mind? Well, I, I did learn that actually Mr. Paxton, that. Mr. McCarty was successful in, in having the Attorney General not go to that hearing. He, he was persuaded not to go. So then what did, you move, what did you move that meeting of July the 22nd? What subject did you move it to? What's, well, it had to involve Nate Paul. I mean, just that the Attorney General being involved in matters like the Mitty Foundation, things again that were not significant litigation matters at the Office of Attorney General.